space because Lod, like people know Lod for being an extremely patient player and he will be as patient as he needs to be but he's also he's gonna go in unless you're not going in you know what I mean like if you if you make it if you give him the option to to camp and go for a timeout and it looks like that might be a path to victory he'll take it but otherwise he wants to go in Shoutouts to Chudat at SmashCon 2015, where Game 3, they both had three stocks left, and Chu started camping the middle and wouldn't approach Lod on the top platform, and Lod had a lead. So with three stocks each, there was a timeout, <laughs> which I've never seen before. That's that's so rare. Yeah. Gosh. Normally you see the timeout at one stock, but not, not three stocks on Fountain 2. It wasn't even Dreamland. <laughs> But anyways, uh, here we go. Uh, I think Lod likes this matchup. I think he's pretty good at it. Um, part of that, I think, is the fact that he has some of the best out of shield movement with Peach uh, compared to other Peach players, which definitely makes the job a little bit tougher for Puff. Walling out Peach with his back here. Admittedly, I've not seen Ace play against Peach too often though, so interested to see what happens. Also, I just realized Ace is using the Lod tag, <laughs> and Lod is using the Tin tag, which is Mom's tag. Yeah, F Smash is um. Oh, he's got a bomb. Oh, tick. What's he gonna do? Talk. Tick. Talk. Tick. Talk. <gasps> Oh, <laughs> he didn't need it. Oh my gosh. He didn't need it. He still got the bomb. Still that bomb is what we're waiting for. Stocks. Okay. Oh. What? Just is it coming down? Oh. oh. Okay. <laughs> Bombs falling from the sky. Brace that combo with the up air. Connects the back air. <laughs> uh, what I was saying earlier, though, is when you hear people talk about this matchup from Peach's perspective, you'll often hear them talk about forward smash. It's Peach's only move that covers that zone in front of her, the, like, the swinging upward arc. And that's, that's typically the angle from which Puff wants to approach. So Puff has to respect Peach's forward smash in this matchup. Nice, downer, up smash. All right. True combo, I guess. I don't really know how downer works too well, but I've seen it work a lot, so there you go. He's got another bomb! Oh my gosh. No, you sh he should have kept it. Oh, <laughs> God. <laughs> oh. He got two bombs. Lot and I played teams on Monday, too, at the cave, and he got two bombs there, too. Not in the same game, but... Got and what you, what you guys see Lot doing there, where he, he Z-drops a turnip while double jump landing on the ground, is called knitting. Uh, it's a new Peach tech, as of, like, you know... I think it's actually old, but no one's sort of using it until this year. But it's called knitting because you're knitting a stitch. So basically it's a faster way of cycling through turnips to get, you know, the, the good turnips. That's very useful. Yeah. And it's you know he's... Find it, like, oh, wow, he calls him out hard with that up smash. And you know that Peach is doing the, the knitting perfectly if there's no light shield. Oh, oh. he definitely... Lot super deserved to, <laughs> to get rested out of shield for that dash attack. Uh, but unfortunately, Ace jumps the wrong way and fails to connect. Doesn't get punished too hard. That's one of the reasons that most people consider Puff to be the winning, the winner in this matchup. Uh, Puff can throw out rest, and if she misses, what's Peach going to do about it? You're really not going to get punished very hard. Same goes for Sheik. Nice wave dash back down to Oh, big dash back down to It's the double jump land and gets the perfect up air off of it. Beautiful conversion log. Misses the turn. Ace is really having trouble. Oh my god. Almost falling through. Ace is having trouble uh, fighting for center. Every time he, he you know touches the little center zone, Lod just smacks him for it. Well, right. <laughs> as I was saying. Gets the fair. <laughs> turn it into forwarder. Really nice confirm. And you see that power shield, Nair out of shield uh, that I was talking about. Lod, Lod's out of shield movement makes it really tough for Cloud. He didn't hit that time, but it's an example of what I mean. It was a good mix-up on the recovery. All right, Ace has to Ace has to uh, do oh, that. That's a good start. Smash. It would be really helpful for him to get a rest if he can. Otherwise, he's really got to play the aerial footsies game, where he sees what kind of 
anti-approach options Lod is going for and baits them out and then punishes. Oh. Tries to get the tech chase. Lod going for something fancy. <laughs> he wakes up in time oh and doesn't gosh. get any punish. Yeah, Lod going for a super cute setup. Just didn't have time for it. All right, now now see Ace has got center and it's way tougher oh. for Peach. Oh, Peach man. has already eaten maybe three or four back airs. And oh. that's stuck. And he dies off the top, so he's got time. He wakes up, and now we have an even game. So it seems like whoever's controlling center get, gains the momentum in this matchup. Mm. That, that, was, that could have been a rest, but it wouldn't have killed. So I respect Ace not going for it. Nice drift on that Nair. Bad DI, oh. but doesn't die for it quite yet. Alright, Ace will make it back on stage. Puff has a pretty good turnip toss, so when I play Puff against Lod and I'm on the ledge like that, I'll actually go for a turnip grab as I'm jumping up. And then you can do whatever you want with it because you got five jumps. Gosh, that was interesting. Oh. Okay, there you go. That, that happened again earlier in that game. The turnip into forward air. Definitely a good confirm. Especially because your instinct when you get hit with a turnip is to DI for survival. Uh, and that sets up perfectly for a forward air. Also, that was a six minute match, but I gotta say, it didn't feel like six minutes. Thank God they're not going to dream All right, Ace taking it back to Battlefield. Yeah. Let's get some more resident sleepers in the chat, unless you actually think this is hype, which I do. This is, that was a good match. Even though it's taking forever. Oh, and there's a there again. <laughs> Lots of nares and forwarder. They, they got a, a rhythm going back and forth where Ace tries to get back to center, Lots his ah, uh, and then hits him back out. I think it might uh, benefit Ace to take a couple minutes to just hang around the corner, see if he can bait Lot into something, and then start fighting again for center. You got all the time in the world. Uh, now it's way more dangerous than it was before because if he gets caught out of place, he dies to an up air. Lod's definitely trying to uh, bait something else so he can power shield it into a float pencil aerial. <laughs> That's exactly what I said he was trying to do. And, right there. and it worked. Probably trying to go for it again. But this time, yeah. So it's very he reads his aerial to drift on that one. Smash isn't going to do too much for Puff right now. Oh, uh, unsafe forward air on shield. Now he's got Peach off stage with no jump. She's got a float. Oh, he gave up oh. positioning there. Now Peach has a jump and a float. She's going to get back, yep. You really got to keep up the, the zoning pressure against Peach when you see that she doesn't have a jump left. Peach back on the offense. <laughs> he walked away slowly. And... Right, hits him again with the Almost fire. dies from that. Up smash, that's gonna kill. Yep. Ace needs the lead. He needs to get a lead back. Otherwise, this game of attrition is not gonna go in his favor. That wasn't even just an un that was not an unsafe forward air. That forward air was fine. The fact is, Law just called out his movement afterwards. Gets that turn up. I think uh, those of you who didn't know how good Lod was, this this sort of matchup is a perfect example to to watch him, you know, in his element, just playing the mix-up game, like showing off some really good Peach tech. Pivot forward smash. That's my favorite. No bias in this match except for when he <laughs> goes for a pivot forward smash. <laughs> Sick. Anyways. Um, this is uh, a much steeper hill to climb for Ace than it was last game. He got I got a few safe backers and he's got center now. So let's he he can't be too greedy. He uh, okay he lets lets Lod get back in center. I think he might be respecting turnips maybe a little too much. Uh, Puff can aerial through them if she times it right. She can also catch them pretty easily. Lod's Lod is going for some style. He's doing some empty pivots now like. He's trying to channel his inner smash god. <laughs> yeah, very nice uh, call out on that jump with the up smash. Lot's got a two stock lead right now. So you see, every time um, Ace gets center, when he loses it, it's when he makes an approach and then lands away from center. I think he should try 
Yeah, I think you should try like, you know, poking Wad from center and then just retreating back to center instead of landing uh, with a shield in this on the side, because Lob will just quickly go go back to center and take it back. Good dash tech. Oh. Not yeah, again, smash. that's. I don't think uh, Puff should go for up smash unless there's no other option. Again, gets his his drift movement option called out right after the forward air. Gets hit with a back air. All right, goes for the up smash. But showing off with some slap dashes which is when he cancels the forward air animation out of a double jump. Nair grab. Flow cancel Nair grab. Peach shield pressure is real, man. This mix-ups on shield. Shelly Puff make it back on stage once again. Nice. It's right. really tough for Ace. Like, it's possible, but he has to play perfect. He really can't get hit at all. And to take out three Peach stocks without getting hit is going to be tough. He has an opportunity now. Nice, oh. that's it. Okay. So he really can't rest. Because at this percent, Peach can kill. I'm a little scared whenever he's going for these jumps above the platform. Because that's exactly why. Because I know Lod's looking for a full hop up air. But he takes it with a forward air. That was a pretty fun set. I love matchups like that in Melee where it's where it's all footsies and mix-ups. Um, another one of those matchups is Marth Peach, which is obviously more volatile than Peach Puff. Okay, I'm up for semis against Plink. <sighs> all right. All right, we just had a very interesting match here on VG Bootcamp. Uh, it wasn't that long, but we got best of five.